I messed up big time last the last session I recorded after we got on the train and I lost a significant amount of footage and now I have to whip the footage off of the live stream which has not the greatest quality so the quality in this video will suffer in the beginning and then it gets better later on since I use the footage that I have not lost due to a sad and very very stupid accident. So yeah. Well, have fun with this. Alright, here we go. Another day, another chapter. Not really, but you know. I can walk around the train now. Ooh. Messenger car light switch, do not touch. Oh. Wow, I found the most boring things already. Hey, we're almost at Cartanica. Wow, they really, really saved that there. They could have phrased that differently and it would have a whole nother meaning. Oh. Emergency stop. Use an emergency stop. Boss. Where did Gladio go? The passing of the Oracle. Lady Luna Freya of Tenebrae lost her life when her summoning of the Hydrogen went terribly awry. Lady Luna Freya was swept under the Altitian waves alongside her fiancé, Crown Prince Noctus of Lucid. Despite falling unconscious for several days, the prince made a miraculous recovery and is currently being treated. And running around with a concussion, probably. Oh yeah, I totally forgot to mention. I have every royal arm now. Because I went back and did the one dungeon that I have left. That I had left and did all the quests that I had left. And the last three royal arms are all story based. One. Tree of the Cas Castino. Scientists have yet to provide sound explanation as to why the research witch for Dina Castino has been overrun by an enormous tree. Experts insist, however, that this floral phenomenon may have been a paranormal preload to the awakening of an annihilation of the gods. What? How much longer? Hey Gladio. You wanna apologize? I would listen. I mean I feel sorry for Ignis. Hi, can I intrude? No? the way you were looking at her. I wasn't looking at anyone. Wait. Is there a new love interest in this thing? I don't think so. That would be... Not, no, that would... Oh. Oh, trains. If they only would be as empty as they are here. Whoa. There's a little party here, it seems. What? No? Okay. In the wake of the Tide Mother's wrath, the government of Accordo has declared a state of national emergency. On behalf of the nation, I would like to express our relief that King Noctis has survived. 
The towering waves that swept over Altisha left great destruction. Still no sign of oh, Lady Lafreya anywhere. It's not looking good. What I wouldn't give to see her again. That has left great destruction, yada yada yada, I guess. Oh, we're almost there. Side quests! Come on! I thought I I thought I was over with the side quests. Why are you doing this to me, game? But it seems we're almost there. They charge us an arm and a leg for this slop? That's Imperial quality for High Commander Flore has been deemed accountable for Altisha's tragedy and sentenced to execution. Lord Ravis Knox Flore was promoted to the Imperial Army's top post amid the turmoil of the failed peace talks. The High Commander's primary responsibility was restoring stability to Lucis, yet his campaign against the Hydrian ended in disaster, incurring monumental losses for the Empire and collateral damage to the area. In the wake of the Tide Mother's wrath, the government of Accordo has declared a state of national emergency. On behalf of the nation, I would like to express our relief that King Noctis has survived. The towering waves that swept over Altisha left great destruction in their wake. It will take time to rebuild our lives. Great, I was listening to that. This is pretty far into the story. This is chapter 10, and I think it One goes... step closer to finding the next tomb. I think it goes up until chapter 15. The Hand of the King. No? Oh, guess I better turn around. What's wrong? I came to the Fadina Castino thinking I'd pay my respects at the royal tomb. Little did I know, they put the place off limits on account of some accident. So you're saying there's no way inside that uh, Faustino Menudo or whatever? Fadina Castino. Where there's a will, there's a way, I suppose, but I wouldn't take my chances if I were you. Ah! Hey. There's an elevator that should take us straight down to the mine. Wonder if the tomb's inside. Those two went to grab a bite in that glorified dining car they call a restaurant. And where's that? Welcome. Oh, there they are. I found them. Yep, that looks like a tomb. There you are. Can you talk to me? Welcome. No, not you! God damn it. There's nobody talking to me. Well, Prompto's still talking to me, but they just keep silent. I don't like that. Oh, pick up. Yeah, sure. Laser sensor. Whatever. Ready to set out. Oh, take Ignis along, leave Ignis behind. Oh, no, I don't want to leave him behind. I'll manage somehow. Well, we made it to the quarry. But our destination likely lies deeper inside. Feeling a little...
little out of my element. We're a foreign species in this environment. Mind we don't end up prey. Right. Good tip. Ignis walks at a lower pace due to his eye injury. Be sure not to leave him behind. Aw, oh, no. Maybe I should leave you at the place. What happens if I do let you leave? No, I think I... Oh, no. I don't want to... Oh! Don't push yourself, Ignis. Oh, no, 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 it's no good, no, 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 What kind of dialogue happens if I leave him behind? I want to know that. Don't worry about me. Oh, it doesn't matter. He will come along no matter what. He will come along no matter what I say or what I do. Thanks for giving me a choice that isn't even a choice at all. Those choices are actually well, the worst. We made it to the quarry. Give Our me no choice what at all inside. if it doesn't have any kind of impact. All right, game. Just don't Feeling give a little choices like element. that are just very We're a foreign species hollow. in this environment. Mind we don't end up prey. Right. Good tip. Character will, however, judge you forever for trying to leave him. Damn it! I should have waited for morning time. I should have waited for morning time. And now he has Pudding's to want. Bad. Watch your step. As best I can. Go at your own pace. We'll wait. Is it too much to ask the royal procession sticks together? Too much to ask you to shut it? Wow. They are really in bad terms now. Come on, Gladio. Why? Why are you such a cunt right now? I really started to like you. Oh no, Ignis is stuck. He's stuck by bad AI. Hey, you should hang back. Was I in the way? No, you weren't. It's just... <sighs> oh no, that looked so awkward. The tomb must be down below. Whoa, careful, Ignis. <sighs> right. They parked here? Huh, wish we could write them a ticket. Who parked where? Nothing but a giant roadblock. Eh, ironic for a vehicle. If we get its motor running, perhaps we can move it out of the way. How about we flip the switch? Hmm. Certainly wouldn't hurt to try. I tried that already. I'm exhausted. This tension for the sake of drama.
chilled food tin, huh? Took more photos today. Uh, you want to see? No, not really. Yeah, of course. Wow, this is all heavy handed. was just sad but it seems so out of nowhere we should get moving you okay Agnes I'm fine don't mind me but I can't this looks promising is it operational we'll see I already were here Hey, what are you stopping for? I'm not. Let's see here. In case of power failure, use backup generators. There's a key in the shed. Wait, you mean the one up at the top of the cliff? Is there any other? Are you kidding me? No way. All right then. Just... Going in alone, huh? Yeah, drive the point home, big guy. Yes, I'm doing it alone to put some pressure off of you. Sorry for being nice. Slow down. You know what? I slow down. I'm waiting for you. Bet you would have said slow down in any case. I do it ask if on, on Steam ask is there a way to not run in this game? And I can say, yes, just don't need to put the analog stick to the maximum, and then they are just walking. I can go camping again after this. Wayne emphasizes the drama. Just for you, Ignis, I go slow now, for the sake that this is the main quest and not a side quest, okay? I mean, we were all here before, but... Just pretend that never happened. Now Gladio is the slowest one, or is he just, or does he just not want to play along right now? This actually would be more realistic if you don't run all the time. Because nobody can run all the time, actually, as you do in a fantasy game. But imagine if you would make the player go slowly.
Here, I found the key. Huh, pretty irresponsible to leave it out in the open like that. Where is the generator? Didn't you read the sign, Iggy? Not funny. Uh. This section of the game is just not fun. Why are they so... I don't understand why they are so cross with each other. Just don't... It, it makes no sense to me. Just Leviathan comes out of this water. Someone's this far. Troops being more important than the story? I think this is an example for that. Oh, it's a giant toad. Well then. No way to work the machine with that thing in the way. Take it out! I could do more. You staying alive is enough. No spas spasms around. Where is it? Right here. How does it look? She's wired and ready. Give it a go. And don't blow it up. Oh, thanks for the advice. Oh, he looks really grim. Did it work? Yep. One more to go. Seriously? Since when are there two of them? Can it? Let's just get this thing moving so we can get on with our mission. Uh, they are angry because they are supposed to be angry now. It's how all the good stories do it. Well, is it really like that, Josh? I mean, you are the um, author, not me. Okay. Oh, you're being sarcastic. Getting dark again. Can I just carry thickness around? My strong arms.
challenge. What did you expect? <sighs> I hate it that it's already dark. We've got the power. Might not have it for long, though. Hurry up and move the machine. Yes, sir. Don't run ahead. You just said move up and... Ugh. You just said that I should be fast. Did you hear that? Sounds like we're clear. Grand. Then let's move. Yep. You're coming. to have the patience for this anymore. Yeah. <laughs> Hold up. You sure you're ready for this? You got what it takes? <sighs> to do what? To face your ancestors and convince them to lend you their strength. Got a long road ahead. Can you see this through? To the end? Resolve. Can and will. Whether I like it or not, I've got a duty to fulfill. As king. <laughs> You're damn right you do. Then that means you'd better start taking this seriously. <sighs> that is what's... Bert Noctis to self-reflection. Now whilst Noctis' vitality has increased by 50%. Oh, and the other one would have increased my strength by 50%. Good to go. We did it! Together! <sighs> Interestingly enough, this time around, being the your actual mood always gives you the strength boost. This cave is huge! The tomb's further in? You wanna wait here? Alone. Here. Not what I said. <laughs> oh man! Something stinks around here! Don't slip and fall and whatever that is! Oh gee. I think it makes no difference if I want to bound in the head. I feel stupid for waiting. Because they will be pissed at me no matter what. Yeah, so much for sticking together. Fuck you, Gladio. You're an asshole for no reason. You know the game developers made you so. Royal tomb's gotta be around here somewhere. 
The question is, where? What about over there? Looks pretty to me, to me. Okay. What is this? I hate eggs. Do we really want to know what's back there? <laughs> that looks like a mouth. Is that its face? What? What is it? Something real bad. Here goes nothing. It's a Malboro. <laughs> the worst creature in all of Final Fantasy. <laughs> but that doesn't matter because I have. The power of bullshit. Bizarre. Keep your distance to avoid its bad breath. Okay. He from the Marble and we go? Okay. Get back. Oh, wrong direction. Fuck. Look who's hatching! Bust him up! Wait, what? What now? Watch out, Iggy. They're on top of us. Ah. First it says run away, and now it says take it down? It's making me melt! A good time to panic. No, there must be a way. Am I missing something? has rejoined the fray. Obtain technique Libra Elementia. Is it dead? It is! And it's all thanks to Iggy. Iggy, you saved us. <sighs> Seriously. 
We'd be plant food if it weren't for you. Happy to help. What, no royal commendation from his majesty? None for you, at least. Was weird. Okay, so it's basically that Ignis can use magic now? I mean, without me giving him some. Whisking them just makes a mess. Better fry them. I think we found it. Just wish they found a better place to build it. Sword. Now we get the full weep on. All right, let's all ass. Yeah, let's. We bought the train, huh? <sighs> I can't return to Andrew? A moment. Is everything okay? It bloody well isn't. And I won't suffer this pointless bickering in silence any longer. <sighs> Let's be frank. My vision hasn't improved, and probably won't. Yet in spite of this, I would remain with you all. To the very end. <laughs> Sorry, but I object. War is a matter of life and death. But we'll be it's there! It's not about us looking out for him! Uh-huh. Well, then he should be free to choose. There's more to it than just what he wants. I know full well! I won't ask you to slow down. If I cannot keep up, I will bow out. <sighs> what says his majesty? Noct, you are king. One cannot lead by standing still. A king pushes onward, always, accepting the consequences and never looking back. Gladio, Noct will take his rightful place, but only once he's ready. Have it your way. We're still taking a big risk. We better all be ready. I have to say something about this. Do you maybe remember the first scene of the game where we stood in front of a very big monster and Noctis has grown a beard and was older and Ignis, Prompto and Gladio were there and Ignis looked like he could see so he will kind of recover I think. Yeah, just return directly to the station, since I already did everything down there. Or was that a mistake? Oh, I sure hope it isn't. You guys mind if we stop in Tenebrae? Eh, might as well hop off. If it helps him move on. Uh, huh. I finally get to visit Lady Lunafreya's home. 
Ready to depart, Noct? Kind of. Oh, there he is. Time to get our journey back on track. Next stop, Tenebrae. Right. Oh, I think I should go to bed. Yeah, I think I should end it here. I mean, we are more or less in the final stretch of the game anyhow, so... <laughs> Might as well get the West done tomorrow. Oh, Gladio has the maximum a HP. Well. Bye-bye then. Hope you had fun. See you next time. As if I have a choice. You think I like the idea of people sacrificing themselves for me? One after the other? Enough. Forget it. I thought you'd accepted your duty. I thought wrong. <sighs> yep, it's one of those. <laughs>